what's up everybody VR gamer dude here and today on VR on the go we are gonna take a look at they suspect nothing now pretty excited for this one because well it's from coat sync and coat sync has done some amazing work on the gear VR they are the developers that brought us the Esper series and a night sky so really looking forward to see what they've cooked up for their initial oculus go offering so let's jump Jump in and let's take a look at They Suspect Nothing. All right, here we are in They Suspect Nothing. And you know, you know what I suspect? I suspect this is going to be a pretty cool game because so far I've liked everything I've seen from Coat Sync. So, all right, let's go ahead and get it started here. Now, I did play a little bit last night, so I've kind of already created my character and uh, gone through the first couple of levels here in the scrapyard. But it looks like we've got, you know, five levels here in the game, two of which look to be unfinished at this point. So hopefully those will unlock at some point. Um, Completed two in the scrapyard here, but before we get started, we'll go ahead and jump into the wardrobe, show you guys the uh, character creation a little bit. All right, and so here is the wardrobe area, <laughs> and uh, so you can customize your robots. You can actually have multiple robots going too, which I thought that was pretty cool, especially since I've got, you know, four other people in my house, and they may want to give it a go pun completely intended um, as well so you've got different heads you've got uh, different bodies you guys get the gist you can customize the robot you can name the robot you can save the robot you can make the robot yours so all right I have already done that I have got my uh, junk bot here so let's go back to the CPU and uh, check out a little bit of the gameplay thanks for visiting well, thanks for having me back again. So, all right. Man, I love the scale of this room. God, it looks so freaking huge. It's like, I don't know, you know, for some reason on the go, I I'm noticing scale a little bit more than I did on my Gear VR. And, and I know that's probably a placebo effect, but it just, maybe it's the Christmas of the graphics. I don't know, but it just looks better. So, <laughs> all right, mustache Roomba. Clean that floor. All right, so let's jump into the scrapyard here and uh, we'll check out a couple of levels. The old cardboard box look. Uh, yeah. I uh, know, man. I'm rocking it well. So, all right. Love this. Love all the little weird robots all over the place and the art style. So, all right. So here's the scrapyard. Looks like the scrapyard. We've got four different uh, well, you wait levels here. Check out my human um, relics. <clears throat> Got some real gems like claws and teeth. Sweet. Also some gems. Uh, well, gems, gems rock. So, all right. So it looks like we probably got to play through all four of the uh, levels here before the next door is going to open. So I've already done runtime and open part surgery. I think I'm just going to go ahead and jump into debugging. Now each one of these is its own little mini game. So pretty cool there. Uh, Can we hurry this up? King Robot starts in five. Uh, hey, buddy. Talbot found the gun and just caught Rory with Jerome. Well, you need to hold your horses there because I'm talking to these fine folks. Uh, but, all right, I'll go into debugging now. Humans kept dogs as pets because they thought they were funny. Whoa! Nowadays, maintaining a monstrous eating machine is dangerous work. For this job, you'll be working with Sparky, clearing the bugs from the backyard. Sweet. Remember... You can recenter your omnidirectional pointer bot anytime by holding the home button. Okay, and let's do that because, you know, I will say that is one thing about the Oculus Go so far that is uh, bugging me, uh -huh, um, is the controller. The controller has a lot of drift, so headset phenomenal, controller complete crap. Um, I, it actually is worse than the Gear VR You've controller, waited long in my opinion. You want to know the so. big secret? Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, left right. right. <laughs> Acadians love that dance. Up, up, down, down, left, left. Uh, I wonder if that actually does something. Watch your step. This pit belongs to the mightiest eating machines in Arcadia. Today, uh -oh. you'll be feeding Sparky, our youngest and uh, liveliest pet. Nom, nom, nom. This is a hard nice. Tilt the controller to move Sparky. 
Oh, okay. Then press the trigger for a quick jump. Nice. Okay, I get it now. Keep an eye out for different bugs. These yellow bugs are everywhere. Eat them to score. Um, what about the red ones? Don't want to eat those, I'm assuming. Watch out for the red ones. Sparky hates them. They make him all wobbly. Gold bugs are Sparky's favorite. Grab a gold bug and Sparky will go into a feeding frenzy. Like... That! There he goes! Hurry eat him! Eat him! Nice! Um, yeah. Reggie's gearing up to charge. Move Sparky hey, Reggie, you need to, to slow your road there, buddy. Okay. Oh, well, that was a little anticlimactic. I thought he was going to stay out here and I was going to have to dodge him. If you're sure you're up to this, let's get shopping. Feeding time. First one, go. There, move back. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> no. Look out! Leave the red ones. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Where's the, where's the gold one? Boo. Got it. No, I didn't get it. Dang it. Yum, yum. Getting me, buddy. No, stay away from the red one. Give me another golden one. Nice. Got it. Yes. You know, this looks like it should be simple, but it's actually not. Wow. You definitely gotta learn how long to hold the trigger down. Okay, I think he's full. Alright, there we go. What I score? Nice, A plus. Yay. A plus. And it looks like I got some general body waste. All right. So. Good work. Arcadia is safe for another day. Damn straight you know it the is. Most dangerous creature in the world. Oh, cool! They've added That's like right. nodding interaction. Right. Like. The Japanese Thunderwolf. One sneeze and it's lights out. If you were thinking humans, they're third after the Crushosaurus. Final test. Then you're officially a citizen. Okay, Let's sweet. See your game right That's here, buddy. Terrifying. Tone it down. <laughs> Take it away. Nice. Loving the little humor in the game, too. I mean, that that just, I, I don't know. It, it's great when devs add that because it really, 
really makes me want to play more. So, okay. All right, let's go ahead and we will check out the last level here. And then I think we'll Axel call it a day like, because lady. it's time for me to eat lunch. So, all right, We're let's friends. do it. As you know, humans are sullen creatures with no sense of adventure. For this job, you'll be salvaging valuable material from a pit filled with deadly thermionic crabs. <laughs> I'm just joshing. It's not that valuable. Oh, yeah, great. So, not about the crabs or anything. Welcome to the slag heap. I know, right? What a beautiful mess. It's your job to dig out salvage and dump it in the right furnace. Simple. Point the laser to direct the old. Go easy, she's stubborn. And dramatic. My CV clearly stated actor, not a compactor. Thanks, Viola. Great energy. First, listen out for the required salvage. I want three gems. Three gems. And three batteries. Move the pointer. Okay. Viola opened his spices to grab some salvage. You can haul up to five pieces of salvage at once. For now, take these gems to the central furnace. There's the batteries. Nicely done. Now, there are three types of salvage. Cogs, which go to the right furnace. Batteries, which go to the left. And gems, which go to the center. Gems are the most valuable, and will provide a score bonus when you deliver the right amount. Meanwhile, delivering the right amount of cogs will provide a temporary multiplier bonus. But don't worry, if you pick up the wrong type, Dump it at the next open furnace to make space. Is that right? Ah, boo. Right on. Quiet. Ah, what's going on here? Now you've woken the locals. Oh, great. If they catch these thermionic crabs will steal your salvage. No! Well Just start world. the game. Arcadians chuck all kinds of here. Finally, grab these batteries and deliver them to the left furnace. Okay, so it seems like all the games have had kind of a uh, similar <clears throat> vibe to them. Which is the grab these, take them here, don't hit those. Oh, cool, I got shields. Great. Delivering the right amount of batteries will provide a shield, protecting you from the next three hits. That's the basics. Let's get to work. All right, let's do it. I want four hogs. Hogs. Oh, got me. Give me my cog back. Oh, oil. Got the oil. Get out of that oil. Alright, what do we got? Batteries. No! Get away from my batteries. Get 
box, get the box. Nice. Sweet. Don't think I did as good that time. Eh, we'll call it a B. They call it a B. I'll call it a B. Works for me. And I got some arms, some spatula arms. Right, down to brass text. And your results are inconclusive. Hmm. I'm sorry if my arms made you nervous. I'm referring you to the Human Detection Division. You're welcome to repeat anything here, but eventually you'll have to speak to Nereza. Well, <laughs> it's not like you can hide in a scrapyard forever, pretending to be the foreman. <laughs> they suspect nothing. Haha. Uh -huh. Q Go had away. the title line. All right. Say, hey, it's you. It is me. So. All right, and uh, it is me about to go to lunch, guys. So I think we're going to go ahead and cap this one here today. But man, let me tell you, a lot of fun. Um, definitely. Uh, okay, cool. And I did unlock that second door now. So definitely nailed it, Coat Sync, as you guys always do. Really loving the game. Love the art style. Love the humor, the gameplay. Uh, so yeah, I, I definitely recommend this one. So I am going to throw a link for this one down in the description. If you want to grab a copy of it for yourself, just head to that link. Uh, I believe it will work with the Oculus Go and the Gear VR, uh, as most of the Go titles are cross uh, platform there. So, but for me, that's it guys. I'm out. This is VR Gamer Dude, signing off y'all. Peace.